what's going on my good people of youtube this is mk the truth Hadil dbnt got some good looking sneakers for us to look at today if you guys are new to my channel come on and join the family also connect to my instagram it is the underscore truth underscore mk also ladies and gentlemen all music is produced by me dldb and we upload them here as well but before we get started though my reviews are for educational purposes only did you know that mk's reviews are analysis purposes only and then we get on up out of here so today i have for you a pair of the air jordan 11 and i believe this is the solo the solo dmp air jordan 11. now i did take a brief gander at this shoe and once again the shoe is looking extremely huge well maybe no 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 yeah, that's, that's 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 about right anyway this is like the was the dmp the dmp 11s right these are looking pretty good so far i got a little bit of schmutz down here don't know if i should be touching that if you guys don't hear from me uh in a couple of days or uh, you know about a week from now a review because i do my reviews in batches <laughs> somebody put out a apb for me <laughs> anyway these are looking pretty good um not too bad uh the toe box looks about right for this uh time period of jordan milky outsole very nice very nice which i got the dmp or the regulars i really don't care too much for this well it's, it's cool but I, it, it doesn't really get me going i understand what the pack is for but it just doesn't really move me like that like the concourse the concourse i'm cool with those anyway got the dmp hang tag of course that's for the air jordan 11 you know if y'all could you can pause that and read that very nice round to the boot 23 in gold very nice man very nicely shaped yeah this is about right for um for that time period that this came out and this reminds me of like that old school mesh ballistics mesh that they used to have up here but anyway these are looking good they got a little schmutz down there but that does happen i can well i just got a little bit of it off right there on camera i can't get that off anyway let's check out this other shoe right quick and you know we got to get on up out of here but yeah man these are looking good the dmp let's check this shape shaping is looking really good really good high cut patent leather okay okay these are looking good carbon fiber what you hitting on you said i'm hitting on i'm carbon fiber anyway man let's check this patent leather that is real patent leather okay all right all right we looking good we looking good shaping is looking really good on this particular pair right here and this upper part is also real leather let me double check that is but it does have an overlay over top of it anyway these look really good i like that you can see like the breakup between these two panels here you can kind of see like some cream going on and i think that's how this is supposed to be on this particular jordan anyway these are looking really good i like the milkiness of the sole kind of matches with the upper very clean man i guess the gold on the back does get me going a little bit not the way you think anyway these are looking really good the dmp edge on the 11s very nice man i'm impressed this is mk the truth deal dbent what y'all think about these man you got the dmps Whew. i i gotta say this before i go now, this is just one of the most timeless, classic, iconic sneakers that refuses to get old. Listen to what I'm saying. This shoe stands the test of time among many. Never looks old, never has, never looked like it's from back in the day or anything. This shoe is t what going on. I don't know what, 25, 20 something years or something like that. And it is still kicking ass anyway let me know what y'all think about these down below this is mk the truth d-o-d-b-e-n-t hey man i love y'all we out